I wanted to make a short beginner video about Monitor Gear and how you can buy it. So if we go to the top left of the screen, click on my icon. Yeah, this is the Monarch gear here. You see I have six different items and uh, they have levels. You can upgrade them and you can equip different sets. So let's take a look at the top left here. You have ground, mounted, ranged, siege, and all troops. And for, for different places, you might have construction or training speed and so on. Generally, you just switch the monitor, just take a quick look at everything. You usually just switch it between your needs. So if I'm going to upgrade a building, I would go and equip my construction speed. If I'm going to do research, then I, I would equip my research speed. Uh, usually, most of the time, I'm either killing monsters or or uh, playing in PvP. So I usually have the healing speed monogear equipped. But the smarter thing to do is use a preset right here. And you have presets for various situations. So when I have SVS, I put my ranged gear, I equip it. And then I have all my ranged monarch gear. I have my healing speed gear and I have march speed and so on. And for my mounted, which I usually use for hunting monsters, pretty similar, except here I have the march speed to monsters. Um, let's say I want to, let's say I want to make a new preset. So I just deleted the ground preset real quick to show you an example. I would go to add a new combination. I would call it ground and I would choose an icon for it. And we have a new combination. Now what we need to do is edit it with the, with the things we want, with the monarch gear we want. So I'm going to choose my ground monarch gear real quick ground 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 and I'm gonna keep it on healing and here I keep it on lumber production that's what the most I have in my farms I usually have sawmills and I'm gonna use March speed you might want March size capacity or troops load if you plan to hit someone with a lot of resources and take his resources but March speed is usually what you need and I would click the the shirt here on the top left again go to ground edit and save so i have a new preset saved if i click on the shirt in the top left can click on any of these equip it change to mounted as you can see and during pvp if i'm attacking with a ground general i would try to equip this before i attack and if i'm attacking with a ranged general i would try to equip this before i attack with my ranged general and during the day to day when I'm just farming monsters, I have the, um, the, the mounted uh, monarch gear preset. So that's about the presets and how you edit them and equip them. And um, how do you how do you get monarch gear? So you get some monarch gear just from rewards from either quest or or spinning the wheel of fortune. You might get some monarch gear also. I got one one monarch gear here, uh, blue, probably blue, blue level one, and a level three ranged gear also, which was really good. Um, so that's one way to get it. You're not gonna get a lot. Um, the basic way of getting monarch gear is buying it from the shop. So you can either buy it by pressing the plus sign here and buy it directly. It costs two hundred each. And you can also buy it go, by going to the shop. If you press the top right where your gems are, you can enter the shop and items special. And you should see all the monarch gear here. So if you really need monarch gear for ranged troop attack or mounted troop attack, you can just buy it here directly. It's pretty expensive, but the, the high VIP players I wouldn't be surprised if they spend hundreds of thousands, if not millions on their monarch gear. I don't think it's a good investment. I, I did spend a little bit when I started out just to have my construction speed bonuses and stuff like that. But um, that's one way to get your monarch gear upgraded and you can spend gems if you need a specific type of gear. 
the other way is in the black market so any monarch gear you find here is going to be cheaper than buying it directly from the shop uh, if you do uh, some math just calculating you need nine level one monarch gears to get a level three monarch gear i i haven't uh, explained it but everyone should know that you you basically need three of each to get to the next level so i would need three level one to get level two i would need three level two to get level three and so on so to get a level three monarch gear i would need a total of nine level one monarch gear so that would if i bought it in the shop that will cost me 1800 gems and if i go to the black market i can see monarch gear for 540 gems so that's already like a 60 percent discount so it's a it's it's a good uh, discount and i can buy it um some some uh, monarch gears here have different prices so they're not going to be all 540 some might be 220 you see a level 3 monarch gear for 220 that's a really good price usually the the monarch gear that's less um less important is cheaper so the wind uh, the ranged difference is going to be cheaper but i'm guessing the range trooper attack is going to be more expensive the construction is going to be full price pretty much the level three construction monarch gear is going to be 1800 so the prices vary according to how much these monarch gears are relevant uh, ground troop attack is a little bit more expensive as you can see but any monarch gear here that you buy here that's a good example it's full price basically construction speed so if i buy this i might as well go to the shop and buy nine level one monarch gear so there's no discount for this one and so on so you you can just you can refresh it a few times and decide if you want to buy the monarch gear the training speed is really it's really cheap and worth it and so on it's up to you that's the other way that you can you can get monarch gear and the last way is patrolling and patrolling is the most affordable and cheapest way in the game to get monarch gear and uh, it the, the downside is that it takes a lot of time you need to refresh for 10,000 and you can patrol for 30 gems and when you patrol you're either gonna get the level one gear or the level three monarch gear so here i can patrol and i get level one gear this usually costs 200 and i can get it for 30. so that's uh, like an eighth of the price it's a it's a huge discount and uh, i can also get a level three gear here again another i think on average you would get monarch gear every uh four or five times you refresh or every three or four times you refresh so the the rates are pretty good and sometimes you even get the level three gear so when you're in patrol and you see monarch gear don't think twice just buy it because it's it's very cheap it's the cheapest way you can get monarch gear so just buy it without thinking twice and you, you can spend half an hour just refreshing and buying monarch gear it's the best way to get it but it's really slow it's time consuming and it's going to take you hours and hours if not days to get the high level monarch gear and like i said players that play a long time they get impatient and they just go to the shop and buy 1000 uh, monarch gear for range troop attack or for ground troop hp um that's pretty much it for monarch gear. there's not too much to to know just know that you can get it the cheapest you can get it is from patrol and you can get it with a discount as well from the black market and if you want to buy full price because you need a specific type of monarch gear then uh, you just go to the shop and buy it directly in the shop it's just more expensive or full price but it's still worth it and don't forget to work with presets here for pvp uh, have your different type of presets and equip them before pvp or when you're farming and so on that's it guys, have a good day.